man, I'm mad. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. Man, I'm so mad. You, you wanna know what happened? I lost my candy, man. I lost my candy. That's what happened, bro. Man, I lost my candy. Oh my gosh. So mad. I lost my candy, man. I lost my candy wrapper. Really, bro? Really? How am I supposed to throw it away now? I can't throw. I can't litter in the house. After five minutes of calming him down, he decided to do the video. Oh, enjoy. Hey guys, I hope you guys like the intro. It's something I made up. But uh, yeah, guys. Um, I forgot to tell you guys that I was, I was gonna be gone for a really long time. I forgot to tell you guys, but um. Fact is, I didn't know how long I was going to be gone. That's why I did most of this. Anyway, wait. 54? Okay, I, mean, I, I got to do this video fast. So basically in this video, um, I'll, I'll, before I start with this topic on the video, I just want to say, guys, I am truly, truly sorry for not uploading. Things have been going crazy. I, I, I can't even tell you. But one thing I can tell you, that homework was piling up on me like if I were in football I would get tackled so many times it'll be like one Mount Everest of dog piles bruh it's like it's not even funny okay it makes me kind of cry at night too but it made me stay up all night I could not do the things I wanted to do including what I'm doing right now but I'm all finished I'm all done I have some more to do tomorrow but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get this video out of the way now uh, um, today on this video I came up with this recent um, thing. You know how the song Radioactive from Imagine Dragons, right? Yeah, you know, Welcome to the New Age, to the New Age. Yeah, you know that stuff? Yeah, yeah I bet you know the song. Um, I had an idea that what if Radioactive was a song inspiring off of Spider-Man? All right, now I know what you guys are thinking. You probably, you guys are probably wondering. Yeah, I probably know how you got the idea. Radioactive, radioactive spider, Spider-Man. It makes sense. But um, I'm gonna break down the lyrics for you. And uh, yeah, um, let me just grab a phone real quick. I gotta search this up. The lyrics for radioactive. Now I never did one of these kinds of videos. Really, I never did like a factual video. Not like a factual video, no, like, not like like those videos, like a a game theory video, something like that. This is not necessary um, a game theory or a comic theory or whatever you want to call it. It's just some crazy idea I had. Of. So, um, yeah, it's pulling up now. Um, Alright, I'm waking up to ash and dust, I wipe my brow and I sweat my rust. Okay, now what do you think? This is, probably can be... Spider-Man, or we should call him Peter. He got bitten by the spider, right? He got sick and woke up. And wasn't he, like, sweaty when he woke up? Waking up to ash and dust, and I wiped my brow and sweat my what? Why would he wipe his brow if he wasn't sweating? Durr! Durr! Oh! Oh, And I'm not even that much into, like, comic books and stuff, really. As much as, you know, I'm just into superheroes. and Not very deep. In the video, vi vi superheroes, I just like video fi um, superheroes. And once in a while, I like looking at videos of superheroes and stuff like that. I'm breaking in, I'm shaping up, then checking out on the prison bus. Now, I'm breaking in and shaping up. Remember how he got really buff after he got bitten by the spider? Shaping up. Shape. Out. Sort of like me. I mean, like, look at these. Like... If I, I mean, if I were to flex right now, my shirt would incinerate. But actually, I stole that line from Swoozy. I'm sorry. I just didn't want to say it, but it's true though. I, I tore through three shirts trying to impress a girl. Okay, I got embarrassed. <laughs> All right, and the prison bus. Well, uh, he could be talking about you know. His butt, if you know what I mean. Checking out on the prison bus. He gotta check on the glutes, if you know what I'm saying. But, but, 
But yeah, he has a chick on the glutes. He has a chick on the glutes. You, the glutes. You know what I'm saying? No, no, no. He means glutes. He means glutes. He's not twerking. He's not twerking. He means glutes. Uh, yeah, my eyebrows are not on fleet. I'm waking up. I feel it in my bones enough to make my systems blow. Okay, okay. Okay, he just woke up. He feels the power of a spider in his bones. It's all in his body. Material, okay? He's basically saying, my body is bizachi. No touch. Because he has the spider sense and stuff, but no touch, okay? Bizachi. You cannot touch. You know what I'm saying. 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 Gosh. And enough to make his systems blow. I bet... That means that he's not a normal human anymore. So if he was a normal human, just take this, okay? Say Spider-Man, right? He can jump high and all that stuff. Imagine if Spider-Man could jump high, do all the things he could do, but physics or laws of gravity or something, or just basically he couldn't take fall damage or something. Like he couldn't land without getting hurt, okay? Just say that, okay? He can get seriously hurt jumping at the height that he can jump at. And when he when he takes his fall damage, enough to make him systems blow, that could mean he's breaking legs. You know what I'm saying? He got crossed up by the laws of physics so badly that he broke his ankles, okay? He broke them. But it doesn't because he says enough, so... I'm gonna look for you. 45 minutes of battery time. I'm gonna make this video go faster. I'm radioactive. Radioactive basically means he got bitten by a radioactive spider and he's radioactive or superhuman. That's basically what it means. And I look like a bird doing this. And every of my friends see this video, another inside joke I'm doing right now. It's okay. I'll, I'll tell you, I'll tell you, I'll tell my fans later the inside joke. But any of my friends watching this video, you guys know what this inside joke is, right? If you don't, I'm gonna slap you. Just joking. I'm not gonna slap you. If I tried to slap you, I think all the girls would come to my yard with baseball bats and beat the heck out. I raise my flags and darn my clothes. Oh. Okay. What's the American flag? Red, white, and blue. What's Spider Man's suit? Red and blue and black and white if you count the eyes or whatever. But red and blue. Primary colors without the yellow. Okay? Without the yellow. Blue, red. On the American flag, blue and red on Spider Man's suit. It makes perfect sense. And he dons the clothes. He dons the clothes. The clothes is the Spidey suit. The Spider Man suit is gonna be put on him. And he gonna be rocking. And he's basically saying, This is still Versace. It looks like spandex, but it is Versace. No touchy. You don't understand. You know what to do. Don't touch me. Doom, doom. It's a revolution, I suppose, and probably me. It's a revolution, I suppose. Probably means of the superheroes becoming superheroes. We'll paint it red and fit right in. Oh, oh stop! Oh, oh stop! Oh, no more. Uh, uh, what, did what did I just okay, tell you, bro? Okay, really? okay, no. What color is Spider Man suit? Red. What color is Iron Man suit? Red. What color can you see on Captain America suit? Red. What color is Thor's cape? Red. What is the color for rage? For honk? Green. That may mean that made no sense entirely. But basically what it means is paint it red to fit right in. Basically what it means superheroes with superpowers. 
get a costume. And yeah, they basically just get a costume, put it on, and now they can be swinging through the city, flying through the city, or even running through the city like a big idiot. But they turn out to be awesome anyway, because everyone loves superheroes. I mean, if you go to the ghetto, I mean, the basic superheroes you'll hear are like Superman, Batman, and Spider-Man. Bruh, that's all my superheroes I know about, bruh. Man, Batman, he can, uh, he's a bat, you know what I'm saying, bruh? Superman, he don't even fly. Spider-Man, though, he can, he be sliding those DMs, you know what I'm saying? He be sliding off the of walls, you know what I'm saying, bruh? You know what I'm saying? Sliding in those DMs. And at this moment, just let him see the clip. I, fine, just get, roll. No. no. Basically, it says I'm breaking in, I'm shipping them, then checking out on the, uh, the prison bus. This is it, the apocalypse. Basically, saying that super villains are coming and we they gotta stop them. The power of Spider Man and all the other superheroes. But the music video of the whole thing is entirely screwed up. Okay? It's about some stuffed animals. I think they have stuffed animals in there. It's a fighting ring, I think. That's what I think it is. But, what if the music video was Peter's nightmare while he was sick getting Spider-Man powers? Spider powers, or whatever you call it. Whatever you call it. Came dirty, dirty deep on his piece. I don't know what to do, son. That was some prank versus prank. Uh... Yeah, uh, my camera shut off. My SD card got full. But anyway, thank you guys for watching this video. Um, once again, I am truly, truly sorry. Sorry. It's just that there's a lot of things I have to explain to you guys. Like, I just have to get it, like, all together and stuff. But, um, I might as well can tell you a little, a little ounce of it now, okay? So, at the beginning of this video, I told you one of the reasons is homework. Yes. Homework has been a piece of crap lately. I don't blame my teachers. I just... The homework, like... Again, the football players, dog piles piling up. It's like super duper... It's not like hard, but like... Okay, for some odd reason, I cannot work without YouTube. Or else, I'll totally freak out. Like... I will totally, it's not like, I will like freak out, like, I won't get it done, I'll say it's too much, and then I just want to go to bed. But when I do listen to it, it gives me like that motivation to like, keep on doing my work and stuff. But the thing is, that makes me even slower. So like, I can even choose to like, do my work slowly, and hopefully get finished with it. Or do my work a little bit faster, but then eventually stop because I can't stop freaking out. So, and, uh, yeah, so there's that for you. But, um, thing is that, uh, I've been a lot in events lately. Um, I have a drama club play coming up. We're doing the Charlotte's Web. I'm John Ardable, the father of the, um, Charlotte's Web thing. Uh. I'm biting my lip. I got obsessed with biting my lips sometimes. Like, I thought that would make me look a little bit cooler. Like, just to do this. Thinking about us, what we gonna be? Oh! Oh, my knee. Oh, my knee. I bit my lip too. Ah! Oh, oh. The goal is to make people happy on YouTube. I'm like, I, I don't... Like, yeah. I, I, I'm gonna try to make people happy, make people smile and stuff like all good youtubers want to do but um yeah that's like pretty much it and you guys might have noticed down at the bottom like right well somewhere right there okay somewhere right there um uh i changed my name it's bwe3 um the reason i did that is because um i it feels like bra since brawl means fight 
and I have the word life on it, it sounds it sounds like fight life. And I'm not that big on fights. Yeah, I felt like my name was supporting fight life, and I'm not about the fight life too. So um, just remember, it's not gone. Brawl life is really not gone. It's still on this channel. Just that I changed it to BWE3 because it sounds like a more catchier name. And plus, when I tell my friends of my YouTube channel, they're like. Uh, get with the Vine jokes, wow. Yeah, they don't actually understand what Brawl Life means. I say, I tell them, what's your YouTube? And they'll be like, hey, you have a YouTube channel? Yeah, I have a YouTube channel. Who are you talking to? Uh, hmm. So, I'm Roman. He's crazy, okay? So let me do something right quick. Everybody, you're welcome. You're welcome. You know, I'll just I'll just see you guys in the next video, okay? Um. Well, so yeah, uh, subscribe, share. Just do all that good stuff, so, um, see you later. It's red. It's red. The ladies don't make fun of me because of this. Hey guys, it's BWE here. Um, check out my friend in the description below. He made a nice remix of me, and, uh, yeah, this is the end, officially.